Hi everyone, I hope you're all okay. So for today's lesson, I'm gonna go straight in. Um, I have got three different items here and I've got some small cubes and I've also got some Lego pieces. Now we've done a lesson previously about height of a tower. So we use the language of tall, short, and obviously you could then go on to um, discuss the length of a tower or the pieces that you use for the tower using the words long and short. So as it's the final term of the summer term, we would ordinarily be getting ready for year one. So to take this upper step, we can use different ways of measuring um, the height and length of different objects. So obviously this does get us ready for year one because we are measuring it. And it's also still part of the early learning goal though, because it's creating your own mathematical problems. So obviously we've got three objects here. We've got a bean bag, we've got a teddy bear bean bag, and we've got an elephant. And we would just want to measure how tall they are. So we can use the Lego blocks. So I've got one, two, Oh, should have probably done this beforehand. One, two, three. So it's still not quite tall enough, so we need some more pieces. Get some more. Oh, got three here stuck together. Let's see if we can get those three together. Oh, so we'd say, and we need to make sure that we're quite accurate with it. So obviously we go from the very, very bottom of the bear to the very, very top of the bear. And luckily, we can see that it is one, two, three, four, five, six Lego blocks tall. Now remember if it's tall, it would go up. So obviously bear should be able to stand and the Lego blocks can go up. We need to try and make sure that we're really accurate with it and not to go too short. So obviously if I was to take one away, that's not quite tall enough, is it? It's not the same height. So we can use this. Now, if I was to use these, would I need more of these or less of these? Can you tell us why? So use as many objects as you can find around the house. You don't have to use cubes or Lego blocks. Just use whatever you have around the house and also have a look at the difference. So I would probably need more of these, but why would I need more of these little cubes? Have a little go with that. Send us any experiments you do with this, any um, findings, any of your scribblings, just to show us exactly what you've been up to. Don't forget to email us at earlyears at primaryschool.org.uk. And we will get back to you. Have a lovely day. Bye.